So Luke says, can you discuss lining a batch box with fire brick splits? Um, in the J, there's only one inch of CFB, CFB on the outside of the core liner. Could I replace some of the one inch liner of the CFB in the batch box firebox with bricks? How important is the V shape that I see in most batch box firebox floors? Those are great questions, Luke. Thanks for asking them. Um, so yes, you absolutely could uh, let those bricks into that first layer of core. So you only had one inch of CFB. Um, on the outside of the brick liner. Now, I've always just used those bricks as just like an inserted um, protective layer of the core that's already there. So I didn't want to remove any material. I just stuck them inside. It, it does reduce the firebox volume a little bit, but I always felt like <clears throat> they're going to go bad over time. I'm going to take them out and I'm still going to have all this material in here and I'm going to start up over again. Um, I don't know that there's any real... Uh, um, there's no disadvantage to doing it that way other than it takes up room in the firebox, but certainly you'll get a neater finish if you let them into that uh, first CFB layer like you're proposing to do, which would match how I do my J cores. It'd be fine. It'd be just fine. Like I said, I'll just reiterate again. I don't think it's necessary. It'll be fine.